Heat warning. Issued at Saturday, 6.35 a.m. July 20th. Issued by Environment and Climate Change Canada. Description. A prolonged period of extreme heat is expected for parts of southern Saskatchewan. Daytime high temperatures reaching 32 degrees Celsius and above, and overnight lows near 16 degrees Celsius are forecast over the next several days. A slow-moving ridge of high pressure is responsible for bringing the extreme heat into Saskatchewan. The heat warnings will likely be expanded eastward over the coming days. Stay out of the sun during the peak hours of 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. whenever possible. If you need to be outside, wear appropriate sunscreen, a wide-brimmed hat, sunglasses and light, loose-fitting cotton clothes. Avoid any extreme physical exertion and keep in the shade whenever possible. Stay in air-conditioned buildings as much as you can. If you do not have air conditioning at home, know where to go to cool down. Air-conditioned public spaces include malls, leisure centers, libraries, etc. Stay hydrated with cold water and cold drinks. Check on neighbors, family, and friends, and have someone do the same for you. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag. The health risks are greater for older adults, infants and young children, pregnant people, people with physical and or mental illnesses, and people with disabilities or mobility issues. Watch for the effects of heat illness, swelling, rash, cramps, fainting, heat exhaustion, heat stroke, and the worsening of some health conditions. Please call Healthline 811 for advice on health risks, symptoms, and precautions associated with heat. Please continue to monitor alerts and forecasts issued by Environment Canada. To report severe weather, send an email to askstorm at EC. GC'd CA or tweet reports using hashtag SKStorm. Recommended action. Heat stroke is a medical emergency. Call 911 or your local emergency number immediately if you or someone you are caring for has a high body temperature and are confused, has stopped sweating or becomes unconscious. While waiting for help, cool the person right away. Move them to a cool place, apply cold water to large areas of the skin, and fan the person as much as possible.